morning ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the day of the video down. How's it going today? Today it is nearly 20 to 10 and we are having a morning at least at home today, which feels really weird. <laughs> Laura has headed off to work and stuff. I didn't have any lectures today. Normally I would be in the library right now, but I have a telephone interview. Not at 12 o'clock, which I thought yesterday, but at 11 o'clock, so good job. <laughs> Good job I didn't think, oh, I'll go to the library until like half 11 and then come back for it. Um, but yeah, I've just checked my calendar. I don't know why I do that to myself. I'll tell my, I'll like write it down in my calendar, have it there, and then I'll just tell myself a different time. But I think it's because you remember things better when you tell other people to remember it for you. So if I write it down in my calendar, I'm like, don't need to remember that anymore. And then my brain will go, oh, let's remember this time. Because <laughs> that makes sense. 12 o'clock, it's a nice round number. Um, otherwise though, uh, the weather actually looks quite nice today. Uh, the storm seems to have passed on, so there shouldn't be much rain. Um, but it's actually kind of bright. It's nice and bright anyway in here. Um, it's less bright, obviously, in the office where the sun doesn't shine through window. Um, but I've been having some problems this morning. Um, I have been having, I've been wrestling with my computers. I'm trying to download some stuff um, using Nextdoor's Wi-Fi. Um, some lecture stuff so that I can do my lecture notes and things but I'm about to just go onto my um, uh, lit review because I can't download them because <laughs> I've tried everything I've like connected my phone to it moved my phone closer to them connect my phone to it and then Bluetooth it to Atlas uh, no to my surface and stuff like that my surface can see it there but it, like you see it struggles um, I've also been having problems with Atlas today. Um, I've started debugging it and I figured out that it's got something to do with my backup drive. Um, so I've like fixed the backup drive, run a couple of fixed things on it. Like it would, the backup drive would stop the uh, USB ports working. Like really weird stuff. But anyway, so I got it working, I like, coaxed it into life and now it's going through and doing like full, a full system backup. Um, because, like I say, I'm relatively conscious of the fact that my SSD might pack up on me this year. Um, in which case, it's good to have a backup so you can just thing you back. Um, I don't think it helps that it's not connected to the internet and it's not, um, like, doing updates and things. Like, Kaspersky pops up all the time saying, like, database is severely out of date. Like, I fucking know, all right? I'd update you if I could. Trust me, you're not under any kind of threat <laughs> from anyone at this precise moment in time. So, um... But yeah, so that's what I'm currently doing in here. Uh, well, I've just, I've just, because um, I was working in pajamas, I've just got had a shower and just got dressed. So I just started talking to you. In here, I've got Atlas running backups, and then I've got my laptop here attempting to download things, but it's not really happening for me, which is kind of annoying. I've got oh no, that mouse isn't. That's really weird. Um, right, where is this then? Let's see, look. Oh, I got a warning yesterday as well about um, data usage on my phone, so... Oh, so I can't even do that. <laughs> That's normally my workaround of getting relatively decent speed here. But even this isn't connected to the internet anymore. No! Why no data received? Nine. Nine, 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 nine. I am literally just waiting for this telephone interview. But I'm like, what do I do with myself up until that point now? Because <laughs> I can't just sit here and be like, I can't just sit here and like fret. You know what I mean? Like, I need to do something that takes my mind off it. So I'm thinking, lit review is the way forward. Is there much point being connected to the monitors? Is there much point being in here? No. Not really. <laughs> oh. But yeah, so this is my day. Uh, we're going to be heading out to the library to, uh, later so I can upload a daily vlog and hopefully get a, like, download stuff, get a decent amount of work done on my lit review. I've, like, got to the point in my lit review where I kind of need an internet connection to research stuff again because um, I've kind of used all of the things that I've already, um, like, researched. Does that make sense? Yeah, all of the things, that, all of the papers and stuff I've already read, like, all of that bit's already gone. So, like, I'm now to the next part where I need more papers and things. And that's also holding me back. But yeah, like I say, nothing you can do about it. Jeez, Louise. So, <laughs> Christ. Well, it's gone. I'm not. I'm in my dressing gown because it's bloody cold. Uh, the wind. I think it's very cold outside because um, it's bloody cold in here. And it's the first time I've ever been like. I've got a hoodie on, and I feel cold. 
I had a cup of tea as well. I made a cup of tea for that so I could like wet my whistle every now and again. And I feel like I just spoke and spoke and spoke. Um, that was a really weird phone interview, it's gotta be said. Really interesting the way it was like put about though because I was essentially role playing as a graduate that was already working there for two weeks. The way he answered the phone was like, oh, is that uh, thing in here? So it's, yeah, just, uh, just thought I'd ring you to do with the uh, email I sent you the other day. So how have you been finding the past two weeks? And I'm like, <laughs> what, what the fuck am I supposed to say to that? Oh yeah, it's great. I'm just like, it's really interesting to see how things are working around and getting to know people and <laughs> geez. Uh, and I had to like pitch an idea for like a networking event to be able to get people from all over the company to start working together. Um, and I start talking about that and then he asks me questions every now and again, like how are we gonna get this to be diverse so that people from different ethnic backgrounds can join in? Like, well, if the entire company is diverse, then it doesn't matter because everyone's invited. I don't know, uh, <laughs> please. <laughs> um, and then it would be like, so a couple of times you've like, what, what scenarios have you been where you've had to solve issues like that then? Um, I'd be like, oh, this and this and this. And I felt like I talk for ages. Like literally, I felt like I was live streaming and it was just a ramble. Every now and again, I'd read a comment or something. But um, he didn't really interject many questions. And then at the end, he like cut it off really abruptly. So hopefully that went well. I don't, <laughs> I don't know. Hopefully it went all right. Um, and I get invited to a, an assessment center out of the back of it. But who knows? It was really strange though. <laughs> like really weird. Oh man. So. Oh god, I need to drink though. That's that out of the way. Uh, I just feel like. The problem is, I have, I'm gonna be honest with you, the problem I have with when I talk about things like team working is I come across like a manager. Like, uh, this is something that uh, they said at my company as well is that I come across like I can like to be in control of stuff. And that doesn't work very well with team stuff. So I kind of get like my backup. Whenever people talk about team related things, I kind of get like a bit defensive, a bit like, um, uh, I kind of get a bit like, I'm trying deliberately not to say the wrong thing. Um, what was a Fisher out in the pond. So I'm um, <laughs> talking about all this stuff and I'm like, is it in the back of my head? I'm like, does this sound like I'm a controlling freak? I don't know, it should do. I'm trying not to. <laughs> so. Damn it, man. But yeah, anyway, so. I'm going to, <laughs> I'm gonna play Xbox, uh, play Max Payne for half an hour and then have my lunch and then go to the library until five, I'm thinking. So it's just getting stuff like my hard drive and my surface charger to head to the library and look. Blood it in. The rain's horrible, it is. Just one. Ah, <laughs> oh, man. That means I'm going to get soaked. I'll just sit here and wait a bit longer. I want to go now. I want to get there before two, man. I feel like I've already kind of wasted half a day. A bit more than I've necessarily needed to as well. No. We are braving it currently. Um, it seems to be very patchy, the rain. Um, it seems to be like either torrential rain and then it just kind of goes to this where it spits for a bit then like downpours again so I'm, like, I'm just going. Um, it should be there for about just after two-ish. Um, whoop, whoop, whoop. To be fair, it feels like I haven't been to the library for a long time. So because on Monday I was ringing up my favourite company uh, and yesterday I was doing like shopping stuff, um, I feel like I haven't been there in a while. Um, but we're going to head there, we're going to try and do some work. I've got quite a lot of admin to do, annoyingly. I've got to sort out YouTube stuff. So, um, yeah, I've got YouTube stuff, got a couple of emails to fire off, a couple of things to download. Um, so it's probably going to take me a while to get into work, but um, should be working by three, maybe. And then I've got like two hours or so. so the uh, lit review is definitely the focus. It's a precise moment in time. Um, but I need to make sure I download all the things that I've got for like my lecture notes and stuff. So when I say the lit review is like the focus, um, it's not actually marked. <laughs> so it's really like, it's not really the focus. Um, I kind of feel in like today has been a bit of a waste, mainly because I've, I kind of just sat at home and next door's internet was really bad today. It's so patchy their internet, it's either like relatively stable 
or like it can't load Google. Like there's no in the middle, like it's never fast, but at least it can do what you ask it to do it eventually. And then sometimes it's just like, nah, lol. And we are en route back home. Um, we got all of my admin stuff, and there was a lot of it as well. Um, I've been trying to sort out things like, um, I had a lot of comments to reply to for what training. Um, just <laughs> had to, um, what words, things, yeah, a lot of YouTube stuff to deal with, a couple of emails to fire out, and um, I also booked a, we're going out for a meal, well, kind of a very quick meal uh, in town, booked a table for that. I have also picked out the headphones that I want now for Christmas, figured them out, now I've found exactly the ones that I wanted <laughs> when I first decided I wanted wireless headphones. Um, someone at work had them and they were awesome and I really really wanted them and I was really annoyed when Bose didn't have half the features of them um, and I'm going for those ones now and it's like a lot cheaper as well so that's good I apologise for the umbrella <laughs> dancing in and out of shop it's very windy um, so I did that what else did I do? downloaded a load of stuff so we can watch um, stuff on iPlayer what I didn't do a lot of was my work um, I spent a uh, about an hour or so like staring at it but I've just been I haven't had the motivation I don't know why that is but I'm just like staring at it like oh I can't be bothered where is the wind well, unfortunately not ridiculously productive but that's life also chased up uh, my favorite company and yep they're still coming to install my internet on Friday good um what else there was something else but I forgot what it was was it important don't think so. Either way, I'm now heading back. I'm going to meet Laura. We're going to cook dinner. Cooking a chilli tonight. We're cooking quite a lot of batch food this week. Um, because although our freezers are almost full, <laughs> we don't have any like quick, quick cook meals. So chilli is... Uh, chilli and curry are two easy ways of doing that. Um, so that's what we're having. Laura's also going to do some baking tonight. She's making um, brookies which are like brownies, but cookies. I don't know, I'm excited. I'm all for that kind of stuff. Oh, Jesus. Uh, I was just raining bloody sideways, this. We've got Apprentice to watch, but otherwise I might just like, I'm kind of in and out of that kind of stuff as I kind of sit and do notes and do stuff. Hang around for Apprentice and cooking, um, but otherwise try and do some work, even though I'm not really feeling in the mood for it. Obviously tomorrow's quite a long day, so I've got quite a lot of lectures and stuff. Um, but I do have a three hour gap in the middle of it as well, so, ugh, and I'm not going anywhere on Friday because I've got to stay and get the internet installed, so, we're all right. Oh my Lord, the weather, I'm not even, it's not even raining anymore, I could probably put this umbrella down. <laughs> it's the evening, ladies and gentlemen, we're about to head off to bed, um, just getting ready now. Um, we've watched The Apprentice and things, I'm like, I'm lacking the drive to do things today. So what we're going to do is we're going to head to bed early. I woke up quite tired this morning. I head to bed early, get up tomorrow. It's Thursday. Let's get stuff done. Um, and we should all be set. Um, otherwise, let's boot it. Princess was pretty good. Um, although the people that need sacking keep avoiding it. Oh. Um, and yeah, that's about all, ladies and gentlemen. Also. Um, yeah, is that it? It's pretty boring, really. Pretty boring. Tomorrow, let's make it interesting and productive at the same time. I'll catch you later.